Welcome to, to this very brief tutorial on how to use PhotoMe, which is a metadata editing software for Windows. It's available online and it's for free. So firstly, I'm going to open up the program PhotoMe. And as you can see um, from the overview, it provides a plethora of information about what you will have currently opened in your program. So I'm going to go ahead and open an image file and it works best with JPEG. So once you've opened that, what you want to do, as you can see there isn't much information here, we just have the recorded version and codex. It actually has no information. So what I'm going to do is, is actually create a file looks like we can't do that with this file. So if your image um, is um, doesn't appear to be editable, it could be because of the size or, or something like that, try a bigger sized image or a different file. Sometimes these things fail. I mean, there could be bugs on the system. What I want to do is open a file. Once I've opened the file, I'll go into create um, IPTC-NAA section. That's what I'll do next. And then from there on, I'll go on to this um, little plus sign and choose whatever it is I want to add from this menu. So right now I want to start with keyword. Um, my main keyword will be my name. I'll apply that. And then I'll add another keyword. You could separate your keywords with commas, but um, I always find it easier to have keywords of different um, in their own separate tags. So over here, I'm now going to put up pages, which is the site where I want it to come from, and then metadata. And then I also want to say uh, software. Whatever your keywords are, this is the field you put them in. So once you're done, you just click apply. And there we go. We've got our keywords there. We actually got two keyword fields. You can add much more like um, location. You can add expiration dates to it. Just experiment, go, go in there and experiment, play around with it and see what you get out of it. What I usually like to do is always add the creator. I think it's important to have the creator added to that. So that's done. And I also want to add copyright information. So let's go and look for copyright information. I'll add that and I'll say this image. And you click your apply button and bingo, we have a more copyright notice the right there. Once you're done, like in any other program, you just click save and you're home and dry and ready to go. So that's about it in this short tutorial about um, PhotoMe, which is a free metadata editing software um, available for Windows. I hope you enjoyed the tutorial, and please remember to check out my hub pages and um, articles for more information on what meta tags are and what they can do for your site, website and articles online if you are not familiar with those. Thanks for watching.